Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, hit the subscribe button in the bottom right corner of your screen. Today we're going to be doing a revamp of my laundry room. So we've been here for two years before I finally made use of the four foot by four foot space above my washer and dryer. I had all my laundry supplies on my dryer, which is where my lint trap is located. It just was not reasonable to continue on the way I was. So I told my husband I wanted to go put these shelves up and we ended up going to Menards and buying all of our supplies. What we purchased to begin with on our first trip was a four foot white hang track that goes across the top of the screen. And we got two four foot white dual tracks that hang down, four 11 inch white shelf brackets that connect into the dual tracks and two four foot homestead pre-finished shelves. Now they had a blue gray coloring throughout on the wood and it just matched our walls perfectly. So these are what we went with. So what we ended up doing was hanging the two shelves above my dryer to begin with just so I could get my laundry supplies off of the dryer. So everything went on beautifully. It was still a bunch of open space on the left hand side of my wall. So we made another trip back quite a while later. It was about a month and we ended up buying another four foot dual track, two more 11 inch brackets, and we got a three foot homestead shelf because it just looked better to go across than the four foot one. And we were able to get everything put up and also a couple of extra supplies as you will see. We had light bulbs and batteries and stuff. Now I also found some decor at the Dollar Tree. I will have a link at the end of the video for my June Dollar Tree haul if you are interested in that, along with my last revamp video for my front garden flower beds. So here I hung the two wall plaques. They're just like a press board up above my washing machine. So the one says wash open 24 hours laundry with some clothes pins. And it's kind of like a barn wood backing farmhouse decor. And then along the bordering edge is a bunch of little clothes pins. I just thought that was absolutely adorable. And then I have a laundry wash and fold service premium 24 seven with the hanger and just a bunch of little like navy blue decor going around that border. And then I also discovered a missing sock sign that I was just blown away by. I was going to make one of these, but for $1, it was just a great steal. So I hung this above my dryer and then I found a spare sock of my daughter's. Three-year-olds lose socks all the time, so she wasn't going to miss this one. And I hung it up there just for some added decor. So all in all, I just thought this looked beautiful. I love the way that my laundry room turned out. I'm sure I'll add some more decor later on, but for now it just looks amazing. And I think we spent under $75 for the entire project, which is not bad to add all these shelves and decor. I also have a retail therapy fun jar that you will see in the bottom shelf in the center here that I found at the Dollar Tree as well. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Give me a thumbs up if you did and make sure to keep an eye out for more revamp videos in the future. Don't forget to check out the videos linked at the end of this video to see my Dollar Tree haul and to see my revamp of the flower beds. I hope you guys have a fantastic day and I will talk to you all later. Bye!